The back and forth about Charleston County School District Superintendent continues. The Board of Trustees voted 5-4 to place Superintendent Dr. Eric Gallion on pay, paid leave last month after just hiring him back in July. Our Molly McBride joining us now live outside of Charleston County School District headquarters. Molly, I understand Gallion sent a letter to the board today. Well, that's right, and on the agenda for today's meeting, it says the board will review a proposed settlement agreement and release of Dr. Eric Gallion. But in a letter Gallion sent today, he says he's withdrawing his request to leave the district. The letter says the more Gallion reflected on his decision to leave, the more he recognized the deep bond he shares with the community. He goes on to say that he's come to realize the trust the community has placed on him is something he can't turn his back on. Gallion's contract began on July 1st, but not long after. On September 25th, the board placed him on a paid leave pending the outcome of an internal investigation after a district employee complained of a hostile work environment. Then, earlier this month, Gallion filed a lawsuit against the district, alleging district policies and the board of trustees hampered his ability to effectively do his job. Now, despite Galleon's letter, the agenda for tonight's meeting still says they plan to discuss that settlement agreement and his release. We'll have that full breakdown on what happens at tonight's meeting tonight on Live 5 News at 11. Reporting live in Charleston, Molly McBride, Live 5 News.